What's going on YouTube? My name is Legendary Lane and today we open up a custom Pokemon booster box. Oh, oh, I'm unbeatable. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, this is by far my favorite video to make for you guys and I hope you do enjoy the most well. In front of me, I have a custom booster box which contains 36 different Pokemon card sets now before we get started in this as you can see for, for a while now i've had the marnie mat in front of me no more goodbye marnie mats hello shining legends mat or welcome back shining legends mat because that's what i had prior to the marnie mat and my luck with the shining ho oh mat so much better than with the marnie mat so we're switching back for this custom booster box opening like i said 36 different packs in today's Pokemon card opening. Hope you will enjoy it. We're going to start it off with Hidden Fates. A crowd favorite. A crowd favorite. But we've got some vintage packs in here as well, as well as some good grade A modern sets. So, yeah. Definitely make sure you're subscribed. I do love to do these every few months whenever I can afford to get all the different packs. I do believe this is the third one I've done on my channel. Um, so there are, excuse me, there are two more on the channel that you can watch for yourself if this one is not enough. And I understand, because I love watching custom Pokemon booster boxes. Our first hit of the day, a Giovanni's Exile looking crisp. I actually need to get my sleeves. I'm gonna get, get these sleeves ready, because I hope and, and I hope and plan to open some great A pools today. And we're starting off strong with our first hit on our first pack, Giovanni's Exile. Look at that. Next pack up, EX Power Keepers. The EX era packs are super, super expensive. So I'm really, really stoked to get into this EX Power Keepers pack, which supposedly is on Wade. We'll see about that. Um, but yeah, let's go ahead and get right into it. I don't know if I know the card trick or not in this one. I think it might be two from the back. One two from the back let's see yeah I think we're good that looks like a uncommon card so we have a Curlia a Laron, Slackoth Chinchu Uchiina Vulpix Shuppet a Celio it's, oh that's the reverse okay sorry that is our reverse not a rare first uncommon and the rare is an Amistar unlucky indeed but we will sleeve up this here reverse because I absolutely love the reverse hollows in the EX era so a little unlucky there unfortunate like I said it was supposed to be unweighed but honestly highly doubt it at this point in time but yeah all right up next is vivid voltage and while we get into this vivid voltage pack go ahead and show on screen our winners who claim the free Pokemon cards from the cosmic eclipse competition to see who would uh get the free cards from the video you had to uh, DM, dm me on twitter and here are the three winners from that competition just so you know that in fact they did receive their cards so here we go we've got a cramorant kakuna eevee trubbish shuppet shootle riolu a magirna reverse rare and an aegis slash v we are starting off pretty dang good Shining Ho-Oh Matt coming in solid for us. Shining Ho-Oh Matt coming in solid for us, for sure. All right, move this to the side. Back to this side, Lost Thunder. I really want to pull that Rainbow Rare Lugia from this set. That would be absolutely amazing. It's one uh, card that I've really been wanting and it looks like we won't be this time. <laughs> oh, all right, one, two, three, and four to the front here. We've got a lot of packs to get through, so I'm going to try to speed up on some of these um, not as fun ones, like Sun and Moon and Sword and Shield and that stuff. Ooh, we've got ourselves a Prime. Prime Celebi card and a Gramble. Look at that. That's a very green card. Very green card. All right, next up is a bit of um, an oddball pack. We have a Japanese gym heroes pack now this is the only foreign pack um, that i have in today's opening 
I don't really like to open foreign packs, but the reason I'm opening this one specifically is this pack right here costs $150. And inside, as a common card, I believe it's a common card, you can get the um, banned Misty's Tears card, which most recently I saw sold in a PSA 10 for $750. And even if you don't get a PSA 10, PSA 9 in that card, $250. Also, this set comes with, oh, it's on the front. I was just about to say, every single time you get one of these packs, it does come with a hollow rare. And we're gonna go ahead, pull the hollow rare Misty's Tentacruel off and set it here in the sleeve. Looking pretty good. Actually looks pretty solid. That could definitely pull a PSA 10 there. But what we're looking for is the banned cards in this set, specifically Misty's Tears. So let's go ahead and get right through today's cards not nice seeing oh let's go that's what I'm saying man that's what I'm saying let's go ahead and get this guy out and I was right it is in fact a common card this card is worth the whole entire the whole entire booster pack it will not get a 10 I don't think centering is pretty bad on it but even like I said a PSA 9 of this card is around $250 and I paid $150 for the whole pack so even in just this one card you're looking at a really good return of investment set that over there and look at the rest of the cards here and man how lucky how lucky I mean it is a common card so it's it's pretty expected to be honest but whoo all right so I think next up was this side so we have evolutions up next Man, we are killing it. Shining Ho-Oh, -Oh, I'm telling you. It's the mat. The mat is what's bringing all the luck in today's Pokemon card opening. Hope you are enjoying the video. I know I sure as hell I am enjoying myself opening these, all these different packs. It's so much fun. So much fun. All right, here we go. We have a Super Potion. Machoke. Venusaur Spirit Link. Growlithe. Machop. Nidoran. Ponyta. Drowsy. A reverse onyx and a char. <laughs> what is going on? Oh my gosh, a Charizard EX. We are killing it out here, man. These are not, I've not weighed, I've not done anything with any of this stuff. It is insane. Oh my gosh, and you can you can go la watch my last one of these uh, custom booster box openings. It's kind of boring because I don't pull a damn thing. It is so boring and I'm like so upset about it, but. We are making up for it. Shining OO coming through, man. Oh my gosh. We're gonna we right now I already have like as many pulls in like the first six or seven packs as I did the whole entire last custom booster box opening. It's absolute insanity. Wow. I'm just mind blown right now. Mind blown. And we still have so much left to go. Eight minutes in on the recording. Oh my gosh, we got a white coat on this one as well. <sighs> a white coat on this one as well. What's happening? One, two, three, four to the front here. All right, we got a Psychic Energy, Fiery Flint, Dragon Talon, Combuskin, Salandit, Wooper, Jangma O, Horsey, a Dratini, a Victini, and a Hollow Rare Altaria. Okay, we'll go ahead and sleeve that up. I don't think it's really worth a whole lot. It's not that appealing. The Prism cards aren't that cool to me, honestly. Um, but Dragon Majesty coming through next up team up a real hot set from the sun and moon era a set that i wish i had opened more of during um its release time but you know nowadays it's it's getting up there like eight nine ten dollars a booster pack for team up one two three and four to the front here so if you want to open up some team up it's going to cost a little bit more than retail you got a brox grit cosmog litten grimer Execute a Larvitar, a Reverse Rare Jirachi, nice, and the Rare is a Nido King. That's a really cool art. I actually really do like that artwork right there. All right, let's set that to the side here. Next up, Primal Clash. Okay, not super old, but not like you know last year. Primal Clash. I kind of enjoyed Primal Clash. Not gonna lie, it was a decent set in my opinion. Um, some people like to hate on it, but, you know, everyone's entitled to their own opinion. Alright, here we go with Primal Clash, Mr. Mime, Electric, 
Dive Ball, Star You, Volbeat, Nose Pass, Spinda, Mudkip, a Baidoof, and a Groudon. Is that a. Nope, that's just a regular rare. Okay. I'll set that to the side because I do actually collect Groudon cards no matter the rarity or, you know, whatever. So we'll set that to the side over there. Alright, we have a Forbidden Light pack. Honestly, don't know what's in this one. Couldn't tell you what's in this one. Alright, there you go with your code for Forbidden Light. Oh, that was loud. <laughs> one, two, three, and four to the front. We're going to go ahead and guess a water energy on this one. Grass, okay. We got a Magneton, Sligu, Frogadier, Pancham, Inke, Dewfighter, Finnegan, Helioptile, and a, and a Porter? In, in a Porter. In a, well, I guess like energy teleporter. In a Porter, okay. And Napoleon is the rare. Okay. So our, our, our luck's cooled off a little bit, which is expected. We were having an unprecedented pull right there. But next up is Phantom Forces. This is a solid set as well. We've got the full art silver Dialga card, I think, in this one. That would be a super cool card to pull here in today's custom booster box opening. Let's see. We got one, two, and three to the front here in the X and Y era. And we've got a Gengar Spirit Link. Crocodile, Klefki, Gumi, Litleo, Finnegan, or no, sorry, Finneon, not Finnegan, Finnanet, Murkrow, Gorgeous, Reverse Rare, and a Bronzong Regular Rare. Darn. Next up, X and Y base set. I don't think there's really a whole lot of cool pulls from this set, but it's like seven, eight years old at this point now, so it's getting up there in age. So definitely what I'm looking forward to opening. One, two, three to the front here for this XY base set booster pack. We've got a special energy girder. Oh, I just dropped, almost dropped, almost dropped all the cards. We got a Mr. Mime, Pantsage, Slugma, Inke, and in, is there, there is an energy. Okay. Phantom, a reverse, we're getting a lot of reverse rares. Reverse rare Age of Slash, and a regular rare by Sharp. Man, our luck's definitely been cooling off here. Next up, Sun and Moon, Guardians Rising. Guardians Rising. I think this is just another one of those mediocre sets. But, um, Rainbow Rare is a Rainbow Rare, so you pull Rainbow Rare from Guardians Rising. Still a pretty solid hit, in my opinion. Alright, we've got a Grass Energy. Sudowoodo, Lampant, Tentacruel, Vulpix, Slowpoke, Machop, Helioptile, Murkrow, a Gudra, Reverse Rare, of course, and a Vanillix. Okay. Okay. The luck on the Shining Ho, a little bit maybe running out, but, you know, next up, we'll pull two out there. A little spoiler alert for that next one. I'm real excited for that one. Generations. Another set people are clamoring for right about now. Honestly, the set itself, in my opinion, not the best. I mean... It's cool. It's like nostalgic, I think, is why. And there's not a code in that. Okay. Whoops. <laughs> Three to the front here on this one. We have an... Oh, it has, it has Radiant Collection as well. So we have an Esper. Maintenance. Metapod. Slowpoke. That cool-looking energy. A Ghastly. Krabby. Reverse is a Maintenance. And a Radiant... Okay. So we got a... That is a cool looking artwork. I'm not I'm I'm not even mad. That is a sick looking artwork. I'm gonna put that to the side. And then we have a Jirachi Radiant Collection. Which I'll also put that to the side over here. Just leave it up after. Just leave it up after the video. Okay, next up, another real exciting set. Flash Fire, probably one of the most prolific sets for me personally I've ever opened. I have opened maybe. I'm making I'm talking maybe. 15 packs of flash fire and I have pulled every Charizard in the set every single one secret rares all of them insane in absolutely insane makes no sense but I don't know I guess sometimes you get lucky stuff like that and sure enough I was on those they did all come back graded as a 9 in PSA they did uh 
That's my one and only PSA return video on this channel. As of right now, we're waiting on some at PSA now. But they all did come back as nine, unfortunately. And Durant. Man. I know that one was on way too. It came out of a 10 and a half. All right, another little story time here. Diamond and Pearl, Stormfront, as many of you know. This is one of the four, four or five sets that has the original um, Charizard artwork from Arita. I've opened before today. This is my second pack of Diamond and Pearl Stormfront that I've ever opened. The very first pack I ever opened of Diamond and Pearl Stormfront, I pulled that secret rare Charizard out of this set. So, <laughs> really, uh, really, really interesting. Also sold that card for uh, $30 about four years ago now. I don't know the card trick for that. We're just going to go straight through with this one. We've got a Ghastly, level 14. Stunky, Magnemite, Trico, Finneon, our reverse is a Farfetch'd, I saw the red, I saw the red and I was like, oh my gosh, it can't be, it wasn't, <laughs> Premier Ball, Shogun, and that is all she wrote, Farfetch'd, is it, was that a rare reverse rare, no it's not, eh. throw it over here in the bulk pile, alright, so we got through, Stormfront and Flashfire without any good hits. Unfortunate, but we're still trucking along. This one was Sword and Shield. Well, we're actually having quite a dry spell. I just realized quite a dry spell, but we do have some really solid pulls in the beginning of this video, which most people only watch the beginning of these videos anyways. So if you're still here, hit me up, up with an, uh, an angry apom in the comment section down below. I'll give you a heart. Evolution Incense, Salazzle, Bisharp, Rhyhorn, Rookity, Krabby, Grookey, Mudbray, a Reverse Ghastly, and a Drampa. Man, we are getting shafted now. Absolutely nothing. All right, next up, Furious Fists. Super excited for Furious Fists. Haven't opened a whole lot of this set, to be honest. I think there's your, code, there's your code card for Furious Fist. Boom. Don't think that it works anymore, but you know, whatever. Here we go. We have a Jaw Fossil, Super Scoop Up, Fossil Researcher, Slacketh, Cub Chew, Patrat, an Eevee. Oh, Scraggy, Trabinch, and an Aurora's Man. The dry spell continues, folks. Next up, Black and White noble victories i don't think this this is like one of the worst sets ever made i believe in some people's opinion i don't think there's really anything why is this not coming there's not really anything in this set worth anything at all like but it's about the joy of opening the packs man like i couldn't tell you last time i opened a noble victories booster pack it's backwards there you go boom uh i think the thing is three to the front one two and three to the front here let's see we got an Eviolite, Swadloon, Durant, Dino, Ponyard, Vanillite, Stunfisk, Temple, another reverse rare, of course, and a unhollow rare afterwards. Yep, that's about right. That's about right. All right, here we go. Darkness Ablaze. Some of the new modern stuff coming back through. We still got, like... 14 or so packs left, so still plenty of time to get some really cool pulls. It says custom booster box opening. Hope you are enjoying yourself today. For the front, we're going to go ahead and guess a fire energy. Oof. Does that mean we're getting that Charizard? I haven't pulled it yet. Oh, we got a heat energy. You know, we're pulling that Charizard, man. We're pulling that Charizard all day. Here we go. Teddy Ursa, Rookie D, Torchic, Trapinch. A reverse Galizabai and oh, <laughs> the gold secret rare Rillaboom. The luck has come back around. We're gonna sleeve that one right away. Wow, never pulled this card. Never pulled this card before. Secret rare Rillaboom. That I told you, man. We're getting some kind of fire pull. That's a that's mm, I don't know. Centering might be a little bit off. That is a sick, sick card. Look at that. Oh my gosh. 
absolutely stunning. And the Glassopod is going to go over here because I do collect just random Glassopod cards. A little fun fact. I collect um, cards of my top 10 Pokemon. Here we go. Cosmic Eclipse, one of my favorite sets of all time. Can we get a character rare or character card? What are they called? Character rares? Character full art? I don't know. Whatever. You know what I'm talking about. Character cards. One, two, three, four to the front. Let's guess the energy again. We're going to guess a water. Not so lucky this time. All right, here we go. Hey, whoa, look at the text on that one. My gosh. That's a novel on there. Curlia, Bysharp, Shinshu, Cosmog, Pancham, Adriel Burr, Tangle. I think this is a reverse spot coming up. Ah. Reverse rare, though. Oh, my gosh, dude. The my camera might be a little crooked. That's nah, fine. Oh, <laughs> let's go. Blastoise and Biblub full art. Oh, my gosh. Back to back fire pools, man. Fire pools. Look at that. Is just wow. Looks pretty good, too. Actually, what was the centering like on the front? Ooh, it's a little bit off. It's a little bit off, but still. Oh my gosh. This is an this has been an amazing opening, guys. I'm already satisfied with what we have, but we got like at least 10 packs left. And next up is Rebel Clash. Wow. It's all because of that shining ho oh Matt. Thanks, buddy. Thanks, buddy. Marnie. I love I love you, Marnie, but. You weren't doing it. You weren't getting it done. We had to swap you out. All right, there we go with a code for Rebel Clash. One, two, three, four to the front. We're gonna guess it again. We're gonna guess a fire. Nope, okay. Got electric energy, charge a bug, a crocheted metapod, burning scarf, farfetched, galarian meowth, caterpie, corsola, litwick, a reverse dreepy, and a hollow rare Galarian Cursula. Which there are no other forms of Cursula, so why is gotta be Galarian? Never understood that. Alright, Fates Collide, just a mass set. Just a mass. We'll go ahead and get into Fates Collide here. Today's Pokemon card opening. And we got ourselves a green coat. I don't think it, the code mattered back in these days. The color of it, anyways. One, two, three. We got a Wigglytuff. Last is special, Ammonite, Gothita, Finnegan, Meowth, Larvitar, Burmy, a Riolu, I love Riolu, one of my favorite Pokemon, and a Reuniclus, regular, rare. Off that side, or this, I think it was off that side. So we got Unbroken Bonds next. Another really popular Sun and Moon set. Sun and Moon did actually have some fire, fire sets, I will say. Here we go. With Unbroken Bonds, there's your code for that one. One, two, three, four to the front. We're gonna guess a Fairy Energy. And it's metal. We got a Devolution Spray Z. Metabod, Strap, Gligar, Spritzy, Doduo, Rhyhorn, Meltan, Kalefa Reverse, and a Holly Wrath. It's kind of a cool artwork, a little bit different. A little bit different. All right, next up from this side, we have Sun and Moon base set, which is where uh, as Mr. Box I used to hold these packs in. Came from Sun and Moon base set. Sun and Moon base set. Okay, there we go. One, two, three, and four to the front here. Ooh, is it? Four? Yeah, it's four. Okay, okay, almost messed up. All right, we got a Psychic Energy, Hypno, Illuma, Dragonair. Bob Leo, Wingo, Surskit, Young Goose, Listen, a Crabomino, Reverse Rare, and a Decidueye. All right. Next up, ooh, excited about this one too. Forgot I had this one. Heart Gold, Soul Silver, Triumphant. I think this one has Legend cards in it, but we're looking for um, some Primes. Those kind of cards is what we're really looking for here in today's opening all right here we go I don't know the card trick so I'm just gonna go with it I'm just gonna go with it first card up is a Diglett Yanma 
Psyduck. Voltorb. Bellsprout. Okay, here we go. Reverse. Rare. Voltorb. And a... Is that a hollow? It is. Okay. So that is a hollow rare Mammoth Swine. And then the rest is just, you know, playing cards. So, uh, wow. It is very hard to tell that's a hollow, though. Like, you can't even... I mean, like... That's so weird. It's definitely a hollow, though, but it's so... Like, such a light hollow. Wow, so that one was truly unweighed. Got that one from Pokey Fiends. Shout out to uh, Rhyme Style for... He didn't really suggest it to me, but I was like, you know what? He seems like he gets some pretty good pulls from Pokey Fiends, so... Let me try them. And I got that pack from Pokey Fiends. Obviously, it wasn't weighed because there was a hollow inside. So, all right. Solid. Next up, we have Breakpoint. Underrated set, in my opinion. You got the Secret Rare Gyarados. Gold Border. A really cool card, in my opinion. Um, that's super underrated. You got one, two, three to the front here. We've got an all-night party with Umbreon and the Dark Boys. Tierno. Sudowoodo. Dot, Chikorita seeing a reflection of a Finnegan. Cursula. Furfrow, forgot that was even a Pokemon. Furrow Seed, Shelter, and a Luxray is our rare on that one. All right, let me set these up more so you can kind of get a little, a little bit of a hint. You can't really see. Oh, well, it's fine. All right, Ultra Prism. Looking for the Lily card. Looking for Lily on this one. Didn't realize for like two days ago that Lily was such a popular and expensive card. So honestly, we're looking for Lily in this one. One, two, three, four. To the front, we're gonna guess a fairy. And it's fighting, okay. We've got a Luxio, Pelpad, Magneton, Chimchar, Simeon, Baneri, Carnivine, a Sneasel, what is, just a random guy in the background there. Cherubi and a Tapu Lele. Regular air. Darn it. Okay, we got three and four. Yeah, that makes sense, okay. Shining Legends. Damn good set. Damn good set is Shining Legends. I had the opportunity to have so much more Shining Legends in my collection right now, like just sealed product. Um, back in like September. Had so many opportunities to just have a, so much Shining Legends, and I did not do it. And I should have. All right, we've got a Steel Energy. Energy Retrieval, Lightbird. Electrode, Golette, Weasel, Scraggy, Croconaw, Jinx, a Reverse How, and a Zorark GX. Whew, another pull. I have like five of these cards. <laughs> like this is, if you're gonna pull a GX from Shining Legends, it's gonna be Zorark GX. I look, no joke. This is the fifth one I have of this card. All right. Okay, here we go. Next up, my nemesis. Champion's Path. Contemplated not even putting it in the opening because of how much I just <sighs> despise this set. But, you know what? I'll give Champion's Path a little bit of life here. Give it a chance to make to redeem itself and make things right. So, here we go. We've got Electric Energy, a Life Bard, Piers, Team Yell Grunt, Inke, Roly Coley, Sizzlipede, Perloin, Scraggy, Hatena, and it's a. Yep, that's about right. Got about four of this card. So, Gario V. That's the thing about Champion's Path. You pull Charizard or you pull nothing. Like, a V card is supposed to make you excited. Not Champion's Path. Because uh, there's just not enough cards in there to keep you excited and. All right, we've got six packs left. Okay, so we've got Crimson. This one feels super thick. That's weird. Crimson Invasion. Eh, it's okay set. People uh put it down quite a lot, but I think it's okay. I think it's okay. Rainbow Ra well, that was weird. My uh, face cam just decided to stop recording because it felt like it. Don't know why. It's got plenty of memory. I didn't have to do anything to restart the recording, but here we are. Uh, so, yeah. There's your code. We're still on Crimson Invasion here. Four to the front here, we've got a Metal, Sogor, 
That is a weird drunk looking Diggersby. Counter catcher, Salandit, Cubone, Weedle, Minchino, Corvish, Numble, and a camera ups. Evolution line there, that back to back. All right, Burning Shadows. Another set we can pull a crazy rare Char Charizard card in. Will it happen? Likely not, but it is possible to do in Burning Shadows. One, two, three, four to the front here. We've got a Metal Energy. Electabuzz, Mount Lanakilo, Kiawe, Krogunk, Pansage, Stuffle, Meowth, Kerbrawler, a Panseer, <sighs> Tangrowth. <laughs> Oh, dang it. Okay, we've got four packs left, guys. Next up, Legendary Treasures. Another really fun set, in my opinion. Um, I recently pulled the gold Zekrom. Or no, was it Reshrom? Oh, I pulled a gold Reshrom from this set a few months back out of a mystery power box. Really, really interesting, but it, this is a cool set. All right. Also, I think it has Radiant Collection in it. Yep, there's a Radiant Collection card right there. Minchino, we got a Pig Knight, Subat, Trubbish, Sowattle, Piplup, Zorua, Zorark, and Zatu, and a Radiant Collection Eevee. That's kind of cool, though. We'll sleeve that one up. It's kind of cool. Kind of cool card. There we go. Boom. All right, guys. Three packs left. This one's kind of boring. To be honest, Detective Pikachu. I had it, so I was like, you know what, I'm going to throw it in there. Might as well. Not a whole lot of fun, interesting stuff in this one. Here's a code card for it. I think all the cards in this set are hollow. We got a Bulbasaur, a Jigglypuff, a Charmander, and a Ditto. Um, let's have a Charmander to the side. I don't, I don't think they're really of notes, you know. But we got two packs left, guys. So you know it's time for the Triple P Pokemon pack today. Oh, I think I hit the size limit on my phone. It's Celestial Storm is the Triple P for today. Let's get into it. Here we go. There it is, Celestial Storm. One, two, three, four to the front here. We've got an Electric Energy, Cacturn, Weeping Bell, the Mast Royal, Culpin, Wismer, Shuppet, Sneasel, Wismer again, Shrine of Punishment, and Clay Doll. All right, guys, last pack magic. You know we had to do it. We had to put the good old boy Steam Siege as the last pack of taste Pokemon card opening in our custom Pokemon booster box. I hope you guys did enjoy this video. If you did. You leave us a like rating down below lets me know you enjoy these type of videos even though you know i i just like to make it but if you guys get enjoyment from it as well that is really really cool and i'm glad i could help you out all right guys we got an ambi bomb nidorino swilus larvesta joltic tangela ponyard oshawott a reverse Rapidash. And we're going to end it with a bang with a Professor Sycamore. Look at that, guys. What a way to end today's Pokemon card opening, man. Oh my gosh, terribly off center, though. Look at the centering. My gosh. Absolutely atrocious. Oh my god. Do you think that can get an OC, maybe? Nah, I don't think so. But jeez, look at that. That's crazy. Let's go through our hits one more time. Oh my gosh, this is a fat stack. It's a fat stack of hits. Okay, here we go. We've got the Professor Sycamore from Steam Siege. An Eevee from Radiant Collections. We got a Lucario V. Screw you. Zora GX. A Mammoth Swine Hollow Rare from HeartGold Soul Silver Triumphant. Blastoise and Piplup GX. Rillaboom Gold Card. Victini Prism. A Giovanni's Exile. A Charizard EX. Misty's Tears Band Card. Misty's Tentacruel Holographic. Celebi Prism Card. And Aegislash V. 
and Decelio reverse from Power Keepers, guys. I had a lot of fun doing this video. I hope you did enjoy it. If you did, like I said, leave us a like rating down below. Make sure you're subscribed, like I mentioned earlier in the video. And uh, until next time, guys, stay legendary.